Good morning, dear children. So you remember we were doing the chapter rock and minerals. We studied about rocks. What are rocks that are of different different shapes, sizes, and colors? Two types of rocks: hard rocks and soft rock. Then we learned that the chalk and the slate or the blackboard that we use is also a kind of rock only. Then we studied about minerals, a more shiny, and different parts of a. Uh, different color different shape and size are the minerals quartz mica feldspar talc diamond graphite these all are kind of minerals only you know diamond is one of the hardest mineral found on the earth it is used for cutting glasses also and talc you know the talcum powder it is made up of a mineral only then graphite is also a soft grey coloured mineral it is used as lead in your pencil so when we write with a pencil the middle inside the wooden part there is a grey type of a uh, long uh, you can say inside there is a grey something from which we write that is called the lead and that refill kind of a thing is the graphite only which is used as the pencil so you can name a black colored stone write any two uses of coal so these conceptual question kindly mark in the book okay i again say kindly mark them in the book now gemstone now we'll be doing the topic gemstone it is a small topic gemstones are the precious stone these are the different different kinds of precious stones used or i again say used for bearing in jewelry or for different different purposes for healing also yes stones are used for healing when someone is not well for a very long time stones are used to heal them this is called stone therapy okay gemstones or stones their body is given massage with the help of these stones and a pressure point is created on the body body ke alag alag parts pe pressure deke us body part ki pain ko heal kiya jata hai now let's read what is gemstone gemstones or gems are very hard minerals they are cut into various shapes and polished now you can see the gemstones are generally like this they are generally like this this is raw gemstone but when they are cut they you get the real gemstone as you can see these are being cut and polished one as you see when they are put it in the jewelry usually they are used in making jewelry so these gemstones are main main purpose is used for jewelry only gemstones are very precious ruby emerald amber and sapphire are example of some gemstones now these are example of some gemstones these are very precious very expensive these are made in jewelry made for jewelry only and these are some examples of them are ruby emerald amber and sapphire so you can see ruby is red in color i can ask you the color also that's you have to remember it ne uh, ruby is in red color emerald is in green color amber is in yellow or gold color and sapphire is in blue or navy blue color okay now what all we read in the chapter for the rocks we all read diamond is the hardest rock used for making rock is used for making monuments etc rocks are of different shapes colors size then rocks make surface of earth rocks made up of minerals also coal is a soft rock and is used as fuel gemstone are hard minerals example ruby emerald sapphire and amber okay now your homework is to do read the chapter once again go through the full chapter if you have any problem you can just go back and go through the explanations given of the chapter do the word b 
Tick the correct option, fill in the blanks, true and false and match the following in the book. In the book. In the next class, we'll discuss the exercises and then we'll do the question and answers. Okay, children. So again, I say do the exercises in the book and read the chapter and do word be in the book. Take care, children. Bye.